just one year old, all the way up to 42 years young. We love to care for these animals and celebrate each and every day with them. Now, are you ready to meet them? Great, because here they come. First up, it's the middle of three sisters living right here at Dolphin Amphitheater. Coming out to give you a big dolphin wave hello, it's Venus. Next up, we have a dolphin that loves to play with toys and spend time with her favorite trainers. Look out so soon for best friend Avalon coming to get you wet. It's Bella! And finally, we have a dolphin that loves to be the center of attention. So look to the sky! It's Lana! And we can't forget about the dedicated
Some of them you are seeing right behind me here today. In my time, I've gotten to know killer whales, I've gotten to know dolphins, pilot whales, walruses, sea otters, beluga whales, harbor seals, sea lions, you name it, even porcupines, beavers, and some birds. So, I consider myself very lucky. It was a long time ago when I sat in these stands myself and dreamed of a day that I would be able to work with animals. And the best part about working with animals is getting to know them. Because believe it or not, each and every animal has their own unique personality. They're all different. People often ask me, what's your favorite animal? And I have to say, oh my gosh, you can't even pick. It's like picking your favorite child. You just get to know each one differently. And each of these dolphins has their own personality. And what you're watching the trainers do right now is just that. It's in these quiet moments that we develop those relationships and we really get to know them. And <laughs> we play, we get to have fun. And if you listen really carefully, you'll get to hear some sounds that the dolphins make. Now those little sounds that they make really indicate to us that they're enjoying it, they're engaged, they're having a good time. You'll hear little squeals and little clicks and they get all excited. <laughs> That's them just having a good time and being dolphins. Well, while we build these relationships because of that, uh, we're able to do all kinds of very important husbandry behaviors with them. And those husbandry behaviors, we're able to take blood samples, uh, weigh them, measure them, and just keep track of their health just to make sure they're a healthy uh, animal and thriving. Now, because of this also, these animals are fantastic animal ambassadors. And they're my, the reason my new friend, Carmen, is it Carmen? Carmen, come on down here, get to meet a dolphin. Come on down here, Carmen. A little birdie told me that it's your birthday today. Is that a fact? Happy birthday. And one of my friends would love to say happy birthday to you too. Come on all the way up here, okay? This is Lana Kai, all the way up. <laughs> Let's give her a wave. Take two hands out like this and wave at her. our hands together, we rub them really, really fast. Faster, faster, get nice and warm and juicy, and then wipe them off on your clothes. <laughs> it's gonna be a long ride home, you guys. Come on over here, Carmen. We have one last thing to do. She wants to take a picture with you, okay? All right, so you're gonna stand right here in front of her. You're gonna turn around and face the audience, just like that. Then a big little smile under that dog mask. She's gonna give you a nice little wave. Aww. <laughs> 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 you get the birthday girl, uh, good girl, you get out of here. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. 